Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Dion. I'm a photographer and I urge you to follow me on Twitter and IG. If you wanna know my thoughts on like K-pop or if you wanna see my photography, it's linked down below for your convenience. Um, today, I know, it's been a minute since I did my photo review series. If you guys don't know, on my channel, I go through different editorials or comeback uh, concept photos from any given idol or group and give my thoughts and opinion um, as a photographer. And today we are doing Stray Kids for W Korea August 2021. Now, fun fact, um, when I originally uh, wanted to do this series, it was because of Stray Kids. I saw a shoot they did for Vogue Korea. I don't know which issue that was. Um, but that shoot inspired me to do this series to get my thoughts and opinions on the photos that these idols take. And I haven't done Sheree Kids yet in this series because I'm not familiar with all the members. Honestly, I only know two. And I don't know one of the two's names, which is Felix. That's my bias. Um, and I don't know anyone else. <laughs> I, I recognize the other boy with the hair that's getting progressively longer, one with the lips. What's his name? What's his name? I feel like I start with H. Well, anyways, I was like, I can't do straight kids. I don't know all the members yet. I can't refer to them in the photos if I don't know their names or anything, anything like that. So I was like, I can't do straight kids yet. However, I was like, you know what? Let me just get over it. I can learn the members as I go, but at the same time, I can still just do the photos. So that's what we're doing today. Um, now that Vogue shoot in question, I'm still going to do it a future time. I'm not sure when, but please subscribe if you want to know my opinion on that shoot and which shoot it is, because I keep forgetting which one it is. I I'm going to look it up later, but stay tuned for it. So yeah, like with all the other videos, I'm going to go through the photos, get my thoughts and opinions. You guys can do the same in the comment section below. Let's talk about it. All right. Okay. So the first photo we have here, there's Felix in the middle and his fellow members. I gotta learn the members of the group. Um, but leave, leave, leave their names below and their positions, please. Um, so first of all, I'll start with Felix. I absolutely love his expression. I love the outfit. Actually, the whole nautical look they have going on here has been my jam for the past like month and a half. Um, so now that, I, that I see this shoe with all these like nautical sea type of clothing, I'm getting my life. And Felix with his hair, and it seems like he might have some freckles. Let me zoom in. Yeah, some freckles. I really, really enjoy that. Plus the blonde hair. And we're going around this way to home it with the striped shirt. I love a striped shirt like that with the white and the blue, with the this jacket over it. I just love the styling so much. Now, what is his name? Because I, rem I, I think he's a rapper. Because I love me some straight kids, like the music. And I think he's the one who'll be rapping. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I think that's him. Um, the next we have Homeboy in the back. I'm loving this like large neckline, it seems like. I'm not sure how long it goes on this side because Homeboy's blocking it here, but I'm thinking I'm digging this. And I can see the bit of the pattern. It's right up my alley. What brand is this? Is it that one brand I like? Oh, I'm gonna look up later. I think I know what brand it is, but it doesn't seem like something I've seen on their website. So I'm about to check that out. But yeah. I really dig that with the hat, of course, and then homeboy on the side with all blue. I like his face in this a lot. He was like, what's up? I heard you said something to say. What's up? <laughs> That's the expression I'm getting from him in this photo. Okay, next image. Right there. Okay, the guy in the back. That's the one I know. I don't know his name. And I think I know his name. Like, it's in my mind what his name is, but I can't pronounce it, so I don't want to say <laughs> but yeah, let's start with him. Um, I absolutely love this. I love the this cardigan button up with these high waisted pants rolled up. It seems. Let me zoom in. Oh wait, it's probably not rolled up. I feel like that's just extra fabric. Y'all see this? It seems like it's like an extra fabric that's at the top, but from a distance, it looks like it was rolled. Uh, but yeah, I like. I love. Wait, the cardigan thingy is also see through. This is a look. This is a look. This is a look. Hold up. I like it even more now. It's see-through. It's, you know, the big old buttons on it. Now, I'm not too much a fan of the hat or the hat's positioning. I like his hair, but the hat being like, like this, 
don't care for. But everything else I love. All right, homeboy in front of him. Let's see, let's see. Okay, we have another Shropshire with some graffiti spray paint. Mm, I can't tell what that is, but I like it. I like it, I like it, I like it. I like his hat. I like the white on white with the pants and the jacket. Oh wait, the pants have red at the side. It goes with the red on the shirt. Come on, styling. And the homeboy in front of him, oh my God, his cheekbones. He's giving us a cheek, a bone. His shirt is so unique. Okay, also with the stripe motif, but it has this chain with these big, large safety pins. Huh. And the safety pins match the gold watch or bracelet he has on. Watch. Um, is that a watch or a compass? Because, you know, it's nautical. It probably, like, you know, on the sea, so it could be a compass. Honestly, y'all, the stylist was not playing no games in this photo shoot. I am, uh, I am losing my AirPod. I am shook, shaken, and stirred. I really like this styling. I need to do a photo shoot with this kind of like nautical like aesthetic because I'm really getting my life. Next, homeboy with this orange hair. First of all, his hair color, I'm living for. I'm living for. And his eyebrows, he better go off. And the full lips. But let's get into the look. I think this might be Beaumont. The cardigan of, oh, he's wearing, but what is this anime? Uh, <laughs> anime DV zipped up shirt he got going on. This is so cool. That big old collar, it's almost comical, y'all. It's almost like it's like it's giving me very much anime. Um, this I'm digging it though. I'm digging it. Okay, next image. All right, we got homeboy. On the side, which he looks slightly like Moonbin from Astro. Homeboy with the with the monocle on the side. Wait, is that a monocle? Is that wait, monocle's the one thing. Binoculars. Are they still binoculars with a little stick on the side? You know what? Anyways, <laughs> homeboy over here looks kinda like Moonbin from Astro. I'm loving the body language. I'm loving his outfit. It seems like it's cinched right here in the middle. Let me zoom in. Cause I can't really tell because it's like it's a deep, deep blue, it seems. So it's hard to see the details of it. But it seems like it might be cinched in, which I like. And I like to see the, these big old broad shoulders with a deep V. This stylist, if you guys know who stylist is with this shoe, or if you know um, if this shoe has a behind the scenes, link it below. Let me know because I am getting my life to this. I, I really am. I really am. All right, so we got the homeboy in the orange hair. He's giving us body. He's giving us shoulder blades. He's giving us... Um, What's this? These detailing, shoulder details on the jacket, but it's also on the on the sleeves. Yes. Is that a lion? Huh, what an it's it's a simple jacket, but I like the detailing on the shoulders and the the um the arm, the wrist. And then homeboy down here. Simple look, but effective. It it, it goes with the color scheme with all the other members. Um come on earrings, looking like a genie. I always associate hoop earrings with like genies. I guess because of Genie from Aladdin, I always see... Wait, did he even have hoop earrings? I feel like in folklore, in general, Genies have, like, hoop earrings. So every time I see it, I think of a Genie. Uh, simple sweater. It's very simple. It's not as extravagant looking as the other two, but I feel like it still works together, especially with the binoculars. Next, we have Homeboy that I know, <laughs> but I don't know the name. Um, honestly, he's my bias wrecker. So Felix is my bias, and Homeboy here... I hate that I always forget his name. Because I know his name, but I just keep forgetting. I like him a lot. Um, okay, okay, okay. We got the what it seems like chalkboard of stars and like an anchor. I love his body language. I love how his hair is. I just love... I think the, the styling is just okay, but everything about the energy he's giving, I'm really here for. Okay, next we have these two members. Let's get the cheekbones. This is the guy with the yeah, cheekbones. Um, he got all this Fendi on. If you guys didn't know, I follow a handful of fashion brands. Um, a handful of high-end fashion brands. So I'm always on top of when they release stuff. Like Versace and Fendi and, and Gucci and all them. Um, so this is definitely Fendi from the Vertical Collection. Which I, I kind of want something from that. I mean, I'm not going to get it because it's expensive. But like, I kind of want something from... Not this collection, but the one that Jackson Wang did. The one that Jackson Wang did, that velvet black on black whole thing he did with them. 
top tier. Uh, but anyways, get to the look. Okay, so now I'm glad I did it in black and white because I don't think they had any type of like navy blue in that collection from Fendi. So I'm glad they did it in black and white because you can't really tell here because I believe it's brown and it could be yellow or blue as a shirt. And it, it would have clashed with the whole aesthetic. You know what I mean? Um, but I like the outfit. I like the look. I like that, you know, it's black and white and whatnot. And homeboy over here. What is this sweater? Now, I do like, okay, it's layered up. It has a sweater, and then it has like a button up, I think, with this long um, collar, but with a turtleneck underneath. I'm not sure if it's attached to something or if it's, another, it's just three layers he has on. I, I know he hot. <laughs> I know he hot that day. Um, I like the styling. He's not giving me much in this image, to be honest, but I do like the aesthetic of what he's wearing with the hat and everything. I kind of wish he had like white. Ew, I'm not a big fan of corduroy, like anything. Sometimes it can look cool. Sometimes I'm like, Ugh, it's giving me like old timey vibes and I'm not really here for it, but it's fine. It's fine. I just wish he had like a white pant on to go with this. I feel like that would have hit harder in my opinion. Okay, next we have, is this Felix? It's, oh, it is Felix. Hold up. Why is his binoculars glowing like this? I'm shook. And I love uh, his makeup. Zoom into his eye. Zoom into the, I always love when they do like br a brown hue in their eye makeup. I always love that. Um, okay, okay. So the outfit itself is kind of simple, kind of slightly disheveled. But the start of the show is clearly this bag with these jewels on it. My goodness. Not even jewels. Is that like diamonds and like colors reflecting off of them? How do they do that? Like how do they... How did y'all add the color? Or do some some of the gems, some of the diamonds have color? I don't know. But anyways. Um, I Okay, so I, I like this picture. However, I'm not getting my life fully. And if I am getting my life, it's just because it's Felix. But like everything else is just, okay. I think it's supposed to be a wow factor with that this particular bag with this, you know, strap with this the jewelry on it. But... Next we have what I believe is Felix again, right? Is this Felix? You guys let me know. I, th I feel like it is, but I can't tell kind of. I don't know. It's his angle. It looks a little different, but I believe it's Felix. Um. Okay, first of all, he got his bundles clipped in, his mullet. Oh my God, do you guys see his TikTok? Let this groove. Uh, uh, uh. Wait, is that the song he danced to? I think that's the song he danced to. I think so. But he had the long, and I mean long, instructions in, um, which I was shook by. I love this look, though, with the, with, the, with the mullet, with his hair flipped back like this, with this hat on. I love the body language of the robe. The styling is simple, but I do like these comically large <laughs> collar. I, I kind of dig it with a deep V. I'm here for it, guys. I'm really here for it. Okay. I absolutely love this picture. It's simple with the posing and everything, but I love what they're wearing. I love the photography. I love the shadows on the side of their face right here. I feel like even though this picture is kind of blue and kind of seemingly desaturated, his hair is still popping with his hat and then this this um, shirt. I feel like, what brand is this? I feel like I saw this brand recently. I want to say it's Dion Lee is the name of the brand. Um, that has like shirts like this. I'm not sure if this is the same brand. I kind of want to go check real quick because I just saw the brand like maybe a few days ago and they just released some new stuff for their new collection. And I feel like, um, yeah, they this their clothing look just like something like this. I'm not sure if I can find the actual factual. I don't know if. This, oh, this is it. Oh, that's the same. Okay, I don't know if you can tell. But this little video is showing, you probably can't tell, but this little video is showing a shirt that looks identical. I mean identical to this. It's, pro it's probably it. It's probably it. Because it looks just like it. Um, yeah, yeah, I believe that's it. But yeah, this, I, okay, I love this look so much. Like, it's simple, but it's very interesting with the jewelry pieces and this type of top he's wearing. Um... 
and the pants and everything is simple, but I love the combo of it. And I just love how the photography looks and his face looks so great. I, like I said, I love the shadows, everything about this. And him over here, I really like his outfit. Now, typically, I'm not a big fan of big, bulky, all the way down pants. However, I feel like here, I can rock with it. Now, I do wish that the the uh, undershirt was tucked in, because I like that big collar with this, this sweater. I just kind of wish this was tucked in so you didn't see the bottom of the shirt. But other than that, I really dig it. Homeboy here, first of all, the body language and the facial expression. He is giving me what he should have gave. <laughs> he, you know what, it's funny because his image in that Vogue photo shoot I saw stood out, it stood out to me the most. He had that blonde hair. It was swooped to the side. It was like down to here. Um, and I was like, hold up. Is that homeboy from Stray Kids? Because I only seen that one image. And I was like, it has to be. And I went to go see the other image. Like, oh, yes, it's Stray Kids. Um, but how he looked, his body language was everything. His hair, how it looked was so amazing. I'm getting a similar vibe. Not similar vibe to that shoot because it's, it's a different vibe to it but like he, he's giving me a model energy that's what i'm trying to say he's giving me what i need i want to photograph him it'd be it'd be, it'd be lit to photograph him um i like this shirt a lot i don't know if it's two different shirts because the lines are downward on the outward shirt and then like this way <laughs> vertical horizontal hello words um so it's kind of like you know different but I, I really really like the contrast of that because your eyes go up like this, but I also go to the side because of the pattern. You got his jewelry on. He got his, I love thumb rings, too. And this belt. What is this belt? Oh. For some reason, I thought it was etched in, like, the Dior symbol because that's how it looked. But I think it's a regular. I'm sure it's not regular, but you know what I mean. It's not, I don't think it's Dior. Um, but, yeah, I love uh, this image. You know what? I There's, a, like, an innocence to this image I really love. They're wearing these big old bulky shirts with these deep V cuts. Again, with the nautical theme. I'm wearing these boots though. I don't know about these boots, y'all. I don't know about these boots. I feel like these boots would have been fine if he had a pant tucked in or even a pant over him, honestly. Either way, it could work. But with these shorts, I don't know. Cause it, cause it, you can tell. I mean, it might be the style, but they look kind of big. Like they, they can just, like, you know, as he walks, they're like hitting his thigh. <laughs> <laughs> um but for some reason maybe because homeboy had, you know like he's smiling or something but i love the vibe of this it seems like they're seeing someone like oh hey what's up what's going on are you ready to hit to hit the boat that's the vibe i'm getting that's why i like it so much oh my gosh this okay wait okay the brand okay wait hold on, hold on. sorry sorry guys sorry sorry <laughs> I got distracted because the brand on the sweatshirt is the same one from the other image I liked. And I couldn't tell what the brand was, which I still, I'm confused. Okay, here's why. The other two on the side, they're wearing Christian Dior. For sure. I know it's Dior on him and him. There's a CD there. I, I've seen this. This sweatshirt in the middle, I would assume it's also Christian Dior, but F-I-C-C-E. Let me see if that's a brand. I am so sorry, y'all. I gotta figure this out. Um, no IG came up. Is it? Wait, wait. Spoke too soon. Wait, wait. Look at these, like, you guys can't probably see it, but there's these sweaters on here. Okay, so that might be the brand, or it might be. Okay, so no IG came up, but it's a. Okay, it must be, it must be a brand. Okay, so I don't think he's wearing Dior. I think he's wearing this this brand that's the name of on his shirt. Um, I'm seeing very I'm seeing various images of sweatshirts that look in the same realm as this. Yeah, this is. So I guess they don't have an IG, but you can search the hashtag. Okay, I love this pose. It reminds me of the picture of the, of the boys, you know, doing their thing. Um, I love the hair. I love the energy they're giving. I love the styling so much. Again, like I said, I don't care for big bulky pants, but I kind of do here. I kind of digging these big old pants I got on. 
I'm really and the fact that he has his orange, you know, um, jacket tied up in the front like that. I'm living for it. All right, y'all. That was the last image. Let's see which one's my favorite. I believe. Um, okay, guys, this is kind of hard because there's like four images I really like. Like I like the one with the four of the guys standing in the line with their hands in their pockets a lot. But I also like Solo of Homeboy here with the stripes. But then I also like the one with the... Huh. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. For my favorite image, I'm going to say... I'm going to pick the one with the, the whole lineup, them standing together. Um, let me know what you guys think below. Where's your favorite image of the shoot? Um, did any of the members surprise you this shoot? Were you kind of like having your bias, your faves, and then this shoot kind of made you question that? Let me know below. Um, if there's any other Stray Kids photo shoots you want me to check out, let me know below. And if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video.